Uh, Trump pulls another ultimate troll move on Kamala Harris by working at McDonald's. You did it. You crazy son of a bitch, you did it. How are you guys doing? Welcome to the channel. I'm Ty Smith. You're watching my channel, Modern Renaissance Man. I really do thank you and I appreciate every last one of you guys taking time out of your day to view my content. Make sure that you are following me on all the platforms you see above and the ones below. Imperative that you hit this thumbs up button. Click that thumbs up button. That way my content can consistently be recommended to you and it helps push my content out in the YouTube shadow banning algorithm world, ladies and gentlemen. Last but not least, double check and make sure that you are still subscribed to the channel because there's a good chance you have been unsubscribed to the channel. All right, so got to talk about this, folks, because Trump did all this talking about how Kamala Harris lied about her working at McDonald's, saying she worked at the fry machine and everything like that and how hot it was and just, oh, how exhausting and everything it was. Well, he's trolling her by going and working at McDonald's himself. And it's crazy because... um. I think it's one of the ultimate troll moves to pull on somebody like Kamala Harris who claimed that she did this by going there and doing it and say, you know what? At least I don't know Trump because y'all know how Trump say he hate to lose, right? He hate to lose. And he has like a competitive edge. So I guess to get like a punch back at Kamala Harris, he's saying, you know what? I'm actually going to go there and work at McDonald's just so I can say I literally worked a fry machine and you didn't check this out. I love jobs. I like to see good jobs. And I think it's inappropriate when somebody puts down all over the place that she worked at McDonald's. It was a big part of her resume that she worked at McDonald's, how tough a job it was. Uh, she specifically worked at the French fry, where they make the French fries. And she talked about the heat. It was so tough. She never worked at McDonald's. McDonald's just confirmed that again, by the way. She never worked at McDonald's. Bring that one up. I'm going to take care of these. Right. Put it in there and just give them a twirl in there. Very good, very good. 
put that in there. Cool. And we're going to take from these ones first. It is first in, first out, okay, the precious one. Tight. We got the salt on it. Never touches the human hand. Very good. Very nice good. and full. Thank you. A minute, I spilled some. <laughs> I'm very superstitious. Now it's over the left shoulder. Now I'm okay. Let's go. All right. So we will start on this side. Yeah. Then. Fine. Okay, put them in standing up, right? All right. Go, Joe. You're an expert at this, huh? Yes. How long have you done, done this? How long have you been? Well, I've been working with that 10 plus. 10 plus? Yeah. All different jobs? Yes. Is she doing a good job? Does an excellent job. She better, right? Does an excellent yeah, job. She's beautiful. Six medium. Five is fine. Five. First order, get three medium fries, and they're waiting for you. Okay, very good. Let's go. Oh, I see. Now I'm going to see that. Oh, that's your customer. Oh, yeah. Wow, it's pretty good. Okay, let's say. Do you believe this? Look at this guy. He's a MAGA guy all the way. Okay, so for his first order. Yeah. Well, that's a good looking group. Hello, everybody. This is not a normal situation, is it? Well, you, what a good looking family. How did you produce those people? Oh, they look like the what? They look like the what? How are you? Thank you. 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 That's great, isn't it? Okay. How cute. This is this car? The next car? Yeah, they get both both bags. You like them both at the same time? Yes, that is right. Hello, how are you? You're a good looking guy. We love you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I will. I promise. Thank you very much. That's on me. Okay? Have a good time. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See you. I'll see you at the White House. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Hello, fellas. Come on. We have another order coming up. And this is their I mean, order? that's thousands of people. Hello. How are you? What a beautiful woman. Look at that beautiful shot. It's like the perfect looking person. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Mom. Good luck to you. Thank you very much. Thank you, darling. You have a great mom? Good or great? That's right. <laughs> she knew what to say. Thank, Thank you, you very much. Again. Thank you, darling. <laughs> wow, so nice. All right, you're doing a good job. Okay, these are nice people we're meeting, huh? Yeah, and this is so he, so you hand one to the head. Harry, look at this guy. I'm not going to mess with him, huh? How you doing, you sir? You look fantastic. Hello. Hi, oh, boy. How are you? Your new baby. How good. are you? Doing great. Kids, how are you? So this is compliments of me, okay? All right. You go have a good time. Don't eat too much, right? <laughs> Thank you, man. You take care. Thank you, honey. Have a good time. Thank you. It's cute. This is fun. I could do this all day. I wouldn't mind this job. I like this job. I think I might come back and do it again. Actually. Thank you. Look at that. Look at that. How are you? Thank you, Mr. President. Nice to see you. It's possible for ordinary people like us to eat. Oh, uh, you're not ordinary. I mean, thank Okay, then, uh, this will be your next order, the next order. Both of them? Yeah. Okay. Hello, everybody. I'm having a lot of fun here, everybody. Oh, look my at, God. Oh, my God. Fake, look at all the fake news over there. <laughs> Hello, everybody. 
this, you can take this, right? And you know, this is compliments of Trump, okay? Yes, thank okay. you. Here's the present. Yes. Please don't let the United States become Brazil, my native Brazil. Oh, uh, we'll, we'll please, keep it good. Please, please. We're going to make it better than ever, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It was a pleasure. Compliments of Trump. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you over there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good time. Thank you. Nice to see you. Bye, darling. Have a good time. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. How good are these people? Did you order anything yourself? I, I'm going to take plenty. I'm going to definitely have French French fries for the plane. Have you seen the people over there? That is thousands of people. Now, be honest. Did that make y'all want to go get some McDonald's? I don't even hardly eat there, but it made me want to go get some. Like, I might be leaving after this and going to get me, like, a two Big Macs and some of them piping hot fries. Oh, some McDonald's. I don't know. Last time I went there, y'all don't be filling that fry box up like they was doing in this video right here. And oh, literally, guys, that was one of my first jobs, too. Yeah, I worked at McDonald's for real, too. Our fry machine was called Shanene, and they fry machines have upgraded away from ours. And also, there was no flipping burgers. I thought I was part of the era where the technology was off the chain. You put the patties back there on the grill, and this machine comes down, and it fries it for you. It comes back up. It freaks you out because you're like, ugh, it's still kind of bloody, whatever. Take the patties, flip them, put them in a long little orange tray, stick them up there. Gary, I'm sorry, but, uh, you know, when I worked there, Gary was the owner of the McDonald's there in Decatur. Out by uh, Metal Arc. Yo, whoever's from the area know what I'm talking about. Uh, we did a lot of free eating there. <laughs> we would over fry nuggets, put them out there. I would just smash some nuggets right there on the spot. I mean, accidentally drop it on the tray right there. You know, y'all, look, the nuggets are supposed to get taken out with tongues, right? So sometimes I would accidentally let one hit the counter, pick that bad boy up and eat it. By the way, I knew Trump was coming there. And I'm not saying McDonald's is not this, but this McDonald's was clean. Like, I'm just saying. They might have just opened up. But that bad boy was clean. The nuggets, sauces, and everything was all lined up in perfect rows and everything like that. Y'all know that's not how I look on a daily basis. I'm just playing, y'all. But anyway, I love how Trump reminded me of Dave from Wendy's. Y'all know what I'm talking about? He and Dave from Wendy's would have on the, the, the nice shirt with the tie on and the apron and everything like that. He just reminded me of Dave. I think that's pretty cool, though, for him to pull up and do things like that. And I love the people's responses to President Trump sitting there serving those french fries like that. Now, there's going to be a lot of people that's going to come out and pretty much hate on this. Yeah. Was it a kind of like a political move? Of course it was. But at the same time, I just thought it was just kind of hilarious and such a troll move to go and say, at least I can say that I serve fries at McDonald's. Let me know what you guys all think about Trump showing up to Mickey D's and serving French fries out of the window right there. Leave it in the comments below after this video, okay? Don't forget the next video you want to see that I would do in chronological order will be up here. Things that I do as a variety on this channel will be down there. I'm Ty Smith, Modern Renaissance Man, hoping and praying that every last one of you have food, shelter, and clothing. And most of all, I pray for the last one of you guys in great health, mentally, physically, emotionally, spiritually. God bless you all through Jesus.